The reason you would want to come and pursue an undergraduate degree in biomedical engineering is because you're excited about what engineering is. The idea of formulating problems, designing solutions, applying quantitative thinking and reasoning to these problems, but doing it through the lens of biomedical issues, biomedical challenges, diseases. You know, that's why we're here. As like biomedical engineers, we want to help patients and our biomedical engineering students through undergraduate research, through internships, through co-ops, through design projects, they're already, whether they realize it or not, helping patients. I think it's pretty cool. In biomedical engineering, our students take three hands-on lab courses, and that means that they uh, spend you know, dedicated time kind of covering all of the main practical sides of biomedical engineering. So we have a bioinstrumentation lab where they focus on circuits and medical device design. Then we have a dry lab, kind of BME Lab 1 course, where they focus on all of the dry techniques like biomechanics, bioimaging, uh, bioelectricity, things like that. And then uh, they also have a wet lab course where they focus more on like cell and tissue culture, um, microscopy and other things like that. So they can go and help our faculty in the research labs or they can just graduate and work in jobs that need those skills. The area that I would say I'm personally most involved would be in the area of undergraduate research. And so in addition to those experiments that every student has to do in order to graduate, many of our students also additionally conduct research in a faculty member's lab. And so when a student is conducting undergraduate research, they're working directly with faculty, postdoctoral fellows or graduate students, actually doing cutting edge research, frequently sponsored by the government or by other entities that fund basic and translational medical research. And there, our students, even very early on in their training, are seeing right up to the cutting edge of what is the latest work going on in fields such as immunoengineering, where we're actually modulating the immune system for the purpose of diagnosing or treating disease, or neuroengineering, where we're actually using functional imaging and recording conducted on human subjects and patients in order to better understand diseases and new treatments for diseases and everything in between. We are a young field, biomedical engineering is kind of a young field that's growing, but that's good. There's a lot of opportunities kind of, and our students can get involved in the early stages and kind of grow with it. OU is a place that puts money in the right places. So like it supports students in providing tutoring. It provides these great lab spaces that they can get the hands-on experience that you know other students and other programs don't get. We have research faculty who are doing groundbreaking research, like developing new medicines, new treatments for different diseases like cancer. And our students at an undergrad level get to like work with them. But it's also this kind of small town friendliness, the combination of both. Um, I don't know how it happens, but I think we're lucky that it does happen. Many of our students build upon those experiences and write, while they're an undergrad, relatively independent research proposals that get funded here locally by a number of groups, but engineering, the Honors College and the Provost Office, and do even some pretty independent research or a very focused project during the summer. And many folks build upon those to pursue master's degrees, PhD degrees of their own, because they got that experience here starting. So yeah, I think it's essential and I think it's why students come here. Biomedical engineering is a great discipline if you love science, but you're not sure which part of science you love the most. Because biomedical engineering allows you to explore all of those and use your knowledge in all of those areas to solve really cool and impactful problems. So for students who like helping people and like science, it's a great combination.